Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. Come on, just give God a praise. I don't know who you are this morning, but you came desperate. Come on, somebody. You intentionally got up this morning, headed for the house of the Lord. Hallelujah. And God, I'm here. I'm here to deliver. I'm here to lift. I'm here to set free. Come on, somebody. Come on, somebody. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. Yeah, 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 uh-huh, uh-huh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You, you, you know what you've been telling the Lord. Come on, somebody. You know what you've been pondering over. Yes, yes. And come on, come on. Somebody said you've been waiting on a blessing. And it seemed it just won't come. Uh-huh. Doors are shut and things are rough. Come on, somebody. If that's you, just lift your hand right where you are. Uh-huh. Desperate. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Just, yeah, 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 yeah. Desperate. Hallelujah. Glory to your name. 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 Hallelujah. 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 Thank you, Jesus. God said I can decree a lifting, and there shall be a lifting. Come on, somebody. Yeah. Come on, somebody. Yeah. He said, I can decree a lifting. Yeah. And there shall be a lifting. Yeah. Hallelujah. Yeah. Hallelujah. Yeah. Just one more time, just lift your hands. The, the one that, uh-huh, it wasn't that many at first. <laughs> Hallelujah. But Lord Jesus, Right where we stand. Yeah, yeah. Hallelujah. Yeah. Right where we are. Thank you, Lord. We're not here by accident. Yeah. But God, you promised. Yeah. And we're standing on your word. Yes, God. Beautiful ashes. Yeah. Jesus. The oil of joy for the spirit of heaviness. You, you were wounded, Jesus, for our transgressions. You were Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. bruised for our iniquities and the chastisement of our peace was upon ye and with your stripes we'll heal we'll heal we'll heal I am healed come on somebody I am healed I am healed thank you Lord Thank you, Lord. God knows the ending before the beginning. And I know what tradition says. And I give honor to the new doctor in the house, the superintendent in the house, my pastor, everybody, on uh -huh, district missionary, all of you all. But I feel a tugging right now. And there is a word, simple word. But right now, God wants to do something. Uh-huh, uh-huh. We can't always wait to the benediction. Come on, somebody. Uh-huh. But let's turn this thing around. <laughs> Come on. And if that's you that are desperate this morning. Mm-hmm. Yeah, 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 yeah. Thank you, Lord. I put my work shoes on. <laughs> and I'm going to let you go eat with your mamas. 
but I need you to just step out by faith. It wasn't everybody, but those first hands, you said, I need something. God is going to do it right now. God is going to do it. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. God's going to do it right now. Thank you, Lord. 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 Jesus. He's my deliverer. Thank you, Lord. He's my strong tower. The choir said, he's my everything. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, yes, yes. I'm not going to be the same. Hallelujah. Woo. The pain is real, but so is your God. Come on, somebody. The pain is real, but so is your God. Hallelujah. 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 Yeah, 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 yeah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. You are my strength. Strength like no other. Strength like no other. Reach it to me. Come on, somebody. You are my strength. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Strength like no other. Strength like no other. Thank you, Lord. 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 Like no other. And in the name of Jesus, like no we thank you for the lifting. Hallelujah. <laughs> we thank you for the lifting. And in the name of Jesus, say that every plot, every plan to destroy, to kill. To steal. We cancel your assignment. We cancel your assignment. <laughs> we cancel your assignment in the name of Jesus. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. We cancel oh, your assignment in the name of Jesus. We thank you for a turnaround miracle. We thank you for a turnaround miracle. <laughs> we thank you for a turnaround miracle. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. We thank you. 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 <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Your anointing destroys every yoke. And we thank you. And we thank you. Every burden. Every burden. That you care. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. Yeah, 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 yeah. Just say yes. 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 No longer talks to and fro. But today he's stabilizing you. He's stabilizing your spirit. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Today. Today. Yeah, 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 today. Yeah, yeah, today. The struggle is over. 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 Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Just tell him yes for real. Yeah, 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 yeah. He, yeah, he's lifting you right now. He's doing it for you right now. He's doing it for you right now. In the name of Jesus. He said, my yoke is easy. And my burden is light. And in the name of Jesus. Yeah, 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 yeah. Every struggle was necessary. Every struggle was necessary. The rejection was necessary. The pain was necessary. And we give you praise. And we give you praise. And we give you praise. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. And we give you praise. And 
we give you praise. Every yoke, every yoke, every yoke be the star. Every yoke be the star. Every yoke be the star. Say that you're a liar. Say that you're a liar. <laughs> Say that you're a liar. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Just praise him. Just praise him. Oh, bless your name. Thank you, Lord. And God, we thank you. Come give him a, give him a yada. You know what that means? Give him a yada praise. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Yeah, 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 yeah. Give him a yada praise. Yes. Yes. Yes, 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 yes. Give him a, yes. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you. Thank you. Hallelujah. Thank you, God. Woo. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, 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 yeah. Thank you, Lord. I still have joy. Come on. I still have joy. After all. After all.
Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I just came to make an announcement. Hallelujah. I, I just came to make a short announcement today. Hallelujah. Uh-huh, uh-huh. That the joy of the Lord is your strength. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I'm not the only one that know it. You're not the only one that know it. Some of you don't know it. But I want you to know today, thank you God, that the joy of the Lord is your strength. Hallelujah. And I just came all the way from Westchester County. <laughs> Woo! To thank God for the joy. Come on, somebody. Thank you for the joy. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, God. Hallelujah. Lord, we thank you for this space and this time. We thank you for this opportunity. And we thank you for the word found in Psalm 16 and 11. God, is, this, is my, this is my scripture for the year, apparently. Thou will show me. You can go with your devices, your Bible. Hallelujah. Thou, Psalm 16. And 11, that will show me, uh-huh, uh-huh, the path of life. In thy presence is what? Fullness of joy. Hallelujah. And at his right hand is pleasure forevermore. Come on, somebody. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. Yeah, yeah. James 1, 2 through 4. The NIV says, consider it pure joy, my brothers and sisters, whenever you face trials of many kind. Uh-huh. Because, come on, you got to know something. That the testing, uh-huh, uh-huh. The King James say the trying of your faith. The testing of your faith produces perseverance. Let perseverance finish its work so that you may be mature and complete, not lacking anything. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. It produces patience. Let patience have its perfect work in you. Come on, somebody. That you may be whole. That you may be entire. Uh-huh. Lacking nothing come on somebody mm-hmm mm-hmm yeah in case i skip it and forget it first peter i'm giving you word i hope you're writing this down so you can go back over it first peter one mm-hmm beginning at the seventh verse that the trial it's in idea again king james said the trying of your faith that the trial of your faith being much more precious than of gold that perishes, though it be tried with what? Fire. Might be found unto praise and honor and glory at the appearing of Jesus Christ, whom having not mm -hmm, seen ye loved, in whom though now you see him not, yet you believe, yet rejoice with what? Are you there? Joy unspeakable and full of glory. Come on, say joy unspeakable, joy unspeakable. and full of glory. Thank you, Jesus. You wonder. Amen. Happy Mother's Day to all of you. Uh -huh. Mother's Day is celebrated all over the world in more than 50 countries, as a matter of fact. But, but, but today I stand to give you what I believe God is given to all of us, the mothers, the fathers, the sisters, the brothers, the children. In this hour, I know in your personal lives, the devil has turned up the heat. Come on, somebody. 
with unexpected tragedies, unexpected losses. Come on, challenges in our finances, challenges in our mental health. Just challenge after challenge after challenge. Come on, somebody. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, mothers, mothers, uh -huh. mothers are, are our sheroes. Uh-huh, I'm telling you, you know what, what we're talking about. Your Shiro is right there with you. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Mothers are conduits. Uh-huh, they, 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 they pass on wisdom, knowledge, understanding. Come on, somebody. They, they are the, the bakers, the cooks, the, the psychiatrists. The, come on, somebody. Mm-hmm, the shoulder, the, the shoulder to cry on, the chauffeur. Come on, somebody. Oh, you know what I'm talking about. Mm-hmm. She's our Shiro, as it were, who, who have the capacity to love unconditionally, mm -hmm. bear emotional and physical pain, and yet have the strength to complete each assignment in the spirit of excellence. Uh -huh. Buchi Imachada wrote a book, and you've heard this. I don't know if they ever made it into a movie. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. It says, the joy of motherhood. Come on, somebody. That sounds good. For all you young women that want a baby and working on it out of God's plan, come on, somebody. Uh huh. Somebody made you think that it was some joy. Come on, out of motherhood. But the marriage bed is undefiled. Come on, somebody. Oh, there I go teaching. Come on, but uh huh. But her, her subject was the, her book was the joys of motherhood. And with that catchy phrase, it was reprinted over and over. She wrote the book, released it in 1979. And the enemy, come on somebody, uh -huh. yeah, yeah, she, that book not only talks about the joys, but it also talks about the pain. She highlights how the joys of motherhood also include anxiety, yeah. obligations, and pain. Come on, anybody want to say amen? amen? Don't act like you don't know. <laughs> Come on, somebody. Uh huh, uh huh. In, in, in case you, 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 you got a romantic notion about being a mama, uh huh. There's a whole lot in that package that you're going to have to have what? Joy to make it through. You're going to have to have the joy of the Lord in order to raise your children in order to stand by them in order not to throw the baby out with the dishwater you need joy come on look at somebody say joy uh-huh tatiana come on somebody just say joy i see you working on something over there in the oven again come on it's all right y'all leave these young women alone that got married and they cranking out one baby after another you ain't having none come on somebody our church need a sunshine band i see the sunshine band coming up bring them to the crater roll bring them to sunshine band you grandmamas that god has has given you what you need come on to keep on keeping on you have no right to say i raised my children and let they raise that they not come on somebody if god has instilled anything in you pass it on now now don't take on the responsibility that's i told vondra them your children Come on, somebody. Don't get it twisted. They're yours. Uh-huh. I'm here for emergencies. I'm here for short honeymoon trips. Come on, somebody. I'm here when you want to go eat to eat together. But don't come taking for granted that I'm the typical grandmama that's crazy. Because there is a season for everything. And after you have raised your children to become young adults and still within them what you need to instill within them, the Bible says that every man must work out his what? Own soul salvation. That includes your grown children. Come on, somebody. And I know it hurts. Come on. You, you see them, you know, you say, Lord, they don't, they a baby, they say, they don't know how to, how to raise these children. Bring them over here. And you about cross-eyed, yeah. crazy, and broke. Come on, somebody. Oh, my God, no matter where that, that's not on my paper. Uh-huh, uh-huh. But understand that God has a season for motherhood. He has a season.
And he has you to be available as a grandma, but not crazy. Because he has instilled something in you after that first season. God has a spiritual seed that he has planted in each of you. Come on, somebody. Say, so God planted a seed in you. Uh-huh. And you are carrying something. And you need to work on that thing. Stir up the gift that's in you now. Don't put all your attention where it should not be. Ah, but seek ye first the what? Kingdom of God and his righteousness and all these things shall be added to you. Thank you, Lord. You're making every effort. Grandmamas, guardians, whoever in your spirit and pass on the legacy of holiness. Pass on the legacy of holiness. Let them see the joy in your life. You know that joy you saw your mama, my mama, the joy she had. Come on. When she was frying her last chicken and know where the next one was coming from, we didn't know it. We were just fixing our lips for some chicken. We didn't know it was the last chicken. Come on. Because she was over there frying and cooking her last pot of beans. And come on, somebody, a big pot of turnips and, and, and a pan of cornbread. And she was saying, I will trust in the Lord, I will trust in the Lord, I will trust, look at that last chicken. She, she, she didn't see no way. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. She didn't see no way for the next chicken because that was the last bird off the yard. Y'all understand? Come on, somebody. We, 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 we had a, a pet chicken. Come on, somebody. And, and somebody say, what was the chicken's name? His name was Chicken. And when we got off the school bus, here come Chicken. Just like your puppy. Come on. Uh-huh. If he heard us at the kitchen wonder, my God, that there come chicken. All of a sudden we miss chicken. Come on. We say, wonder what happened to chicken. I didn't figure it out until I got grown and rusty. I think that might have been the last meal of the day. Come on, somebody. But mama didn't go around pouting and, and giving us up so saying, I don't know what gonna happen tomorrow cheering your body enjoy this meal stop laying pain and heartache and stress on your children if you have the joy of the lord they won't even know when you're having a hard day they won't even know when you're down because they see god lift you up come on somebody you don't have a sad story but you let them know baby that's what God told Moses. Tell them children. Testify to your children. And tell them it wasn't GE's money that brought you them bubble gums. It wasn't GE's money that got us in this house. It wasn't your daddy or your mama's job. But if it had not been for the Lord who was on our side, if it had not been for the Lord who brought us up, and brought us out now may Israel say if it had not been come on somebody give him praise thank you Jesus every trial every temptation every hard place my God if you have the joy of the Lord my God it will give you what you need to take a licking and keep on ticking. Come on, somebody. Somebody watching saying, how is she going through? She, you know they're looking for you to crack up. They're standing back like them people on the other end of the fiery furnace. Wasn't looking for them to come out. Come on, somebody. They're looking for you to crack up and give up and give out. And Come on, somebody. And just go pull the blinds and be depressed. My God Almighty. But the joy of the Lord... It's my secret weapon. Look at somebody say the joy of the Lord is my secret weapon. The joy of the Lord in the middle of the battle.
is my secret weapon. Uh huh, uh huh. One, one writer said that joy is a choice. Come on, somebody. Joy, a feeling of great pleasure and jubilation. Somebody may not know what joy means. It doesn't mean that you, you get joy when you go to the mailbox and you get your check. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh huh. Or go to the bank and think you got 50 cent and you got a dollar 50 cent. Uh huh, uh huh, uh huh. But that joy. Uh huh, uh huh. That spiritual joy is the remarkable, unnatural ability to respond to external, adverse, disturbing circumstances with inner contentment and satisfaction. No, I'm not on crack. I don't do cocaine. And I know what the doctor said about my husband's condition. Come on, somebody. I know what he said about my condition. I'm not taking nothing. I'm not on nothing. But my face sees what the doctor don't see. Come on, somebody. The joy in my heart, come on, uh -huh, uh -huh, keeps me going in spite of what I see. The joy of the Lord. The joy of the Lord. Superintendent, I know what the doctor say. Uh huh, uh huh, uh huh. It may be medical facts, but it's not biblical facts. Because the biblical facts says, like David says, I shall live and not die. I will declare the glory of the Lord in the land of the living. Come on, somebody. So wait on him. Be of good courage. And he shall strengthen. Your heart. Come on, somebody. Somebody said joy is a choice, but I beg to differ. Joy comes from the Lord. Uh huh, uh huh. When James says, count it all joy, uh, Pat Lofton, uh huh, my brain can't understand that. Uh huh. And I, I, and I know, I know the naysayers when, when, when they see me coming in with my tambourine, don't even sit down, beating and a jumping and a shouting and a crying. They say she can't be that happy. Oh yes, I can. Uh huh. You know what they? Don't you worry about what folks say about you. Praising the Lord. Come on, somebody. Don't don't you worry about uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. Lady Bug, you know, somebody said that big tambourine look like she gonna give out. Come on, no, 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 beat it the hardest. <laughs> Miriam, Miriam was about 80 years old, but she led to praise. Because in spite of what she saw, in spite of what she heard, in spite of the devil flouncing and carrying on and threatening, she led the praise with her tambourine and said, I've got the victory. Hallelujah. Come on, somebody. I've got the victory. Hallelujah. Come on, somebody. I've got the victory. I've got the victory. Hallelujah. Every knee shall bow. That he is Lord. He is Lord. Every knee. Every tongue. He is Lord. He is Lord. Now there are two types of joy. That, that uh, the Bible implicates that there's two types of joy. Come on, come on. Uh-huh. Number one, he talks about unspeakable joy. Yeah. Ah! yeah, 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 yeah. Hallelujah. I was praying the other morning in my little closet. Mother Anderson said, it's a shame you put the Lord through all that before you get a word. Come on, somebody. She know what I'm talking about. Uh-huh, uh-huh. But I, 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 I was just telling the Lord, Lord, what am I going to do? How, how am I going to figure this thing out? So much. So, it was so much. Uh-huh, uh-huh. And, and, and I began to get my little list together. Y'all know what I do. I tell you, I confess this. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Before I could do it, Sister Tanya, I, I start saying, thank you for the joy. Thank you for the joy. <laughs> thank you for the joy. Thank you for the joy. Thank you for the joy. You, you don't have to wonder how you are making it through, how you made it through the last few weeks and the last year. It was the joy of the Lord that brought you through. Come on, somebody say thank you for the joy. And it says unspeakable joy. First Peter, mm -hmm. he's, he's talked about unspeakable joy. That means I can't express it. 
I can't explain it. I can't explain it. Come on. Uh-huh, uh-huh. You, you, you understand. I, I can't explain it. I should have, I, I should have slapped somebody. I, I should have, you know what I'm saying? Uh, uh, yeah, yeah. I, I ain't my deal. I don't carry a piece. But uh, come on, somebody. But sometimes that may make you want to wish you had a piece. Come on, somebody. But I still have joy. <laughs> when it's all over, and when the other woman I sit on, look at somebody, mothers, and say, "There's another woman in me." Every now and then, that other woman wants to come out but the bible the word of god comes up in my spirit lets me know that the weapons of our warfare are not carnal but they are mighty to god to the pulling down of strongholds the casting down of imagination and every thought that exhorts itself against the knowledge of God. And when it's all over, when the cookie crumble, at the end of the day, I still have joy. I still have joy. Come on, after all, I still have joy. Come on, testify to somebody. After all the things, I still have joy. Then it talks about full joy. Now this this is where I've, I've, I'm looking at Facebook, you know, scrolling and ask the Lord to deliver me, you know, help me, help me to give it only a few minutes a day. Uh huh. It, it talks about full joy. Mm hmm. And God is sick of me every day, repenting for that. He, he don't strive with a thaw ways. I'm talking to Pat Lofton, okay? Mm-hmm, 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 mm-hmm. So, so that's one of the things I'm working on, is putting as much time in prayer, putting as much time in reflection, putting as much time, come on somebody, in the word of God that sustains. The Bible says the word of the Lord. Ah, it's a strong tower. The righteous run into it and are uh, what? Safe. Come on, somebody say safe. Okay, okay. Uh-huh, uh uh-huh. I'm looking at the time. I'm, I'm going to shut up. It talks about full joy. Mm-hmm. John 15 and 11. Just write that down quickly. These things have I spoken unto you that my joy might remain in you. The devil is out to steal your joy and to drain you. Jesus reminded Peter, he said, Peter, the devil desires to sift you as wheat. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. But, but, but he says, I, I, this, the, the word I write to you that, your, that, 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 that my joy might remain in you. Remain, remain, remain. But how many, if you be honest, find out the things you've been going through and the things you've been involved in, before you know it, your joy is waning. Yeah. I can tell. Yeah. Mm -hmm. right. when, when, we're going to see how much joy. We're going to get some more joy. The, when is it Thursday, Friday, and Saturday? When is the third? What in the Vegas? Uh -huh. When is the Thursday and Friday? Uh -huh. David says, Lord, restore unto me the joy of thy salvation. So that your joy might remain, mean continue to exist, so that you can be like that ball with some bounce in it, some uh -huh, that, that you can bounce with it. Uh-huh. That full joy, that your joy, my joy may remain in you, and that uh-huh, your joy might be what? F-U-L-L. -L. What that spell? Full. That your joy might be full. Faith temple. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Saints of the Most High that's in the house. Uh-huh. All of you that's in the house. It's God's desire that your joy be full. Come on, somebody. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Deacon Mason, it's good to see you. God wants your joy full. Whatever you're going through, God wants you to be able to make it through. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. 
with flying colors. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Like, like, mm -hmm, uh -huh. It was some work behind it. But he said that your joy might be full, meaning having no what? Empty space. No empty space. No room for junk. No room for garbage. No room for negativity. No room for depression. No room for prolonged anger. No room for bitterness. No room for resentment, strife, contention, or disobedience. But in his presence is fullness of joy. Come on, somebody. Just stand up where you are and testify to somebody. Uh-huh. And say, I still have joy. I still uh huh. After all I've been through, I still have joy. Come on. Hallelujah. After all, come on, tell somebody. Thank you, Lord. I want to tell you this. Somebody said, how can I get that joy? It's the source of that joy. God is the source. But he sent the Holy Ghost. I'm not judging. Just fruit inspecting. Too many of us don't have the Holy Ghost. Come on, somebody. Too many of us. Come on. Don't have the Holy Ghost. And the fruit of the Spirit in Galatians, the sixth chapter, lets us know the first two, but the fruit of the Spirit is what? Love. The second one is joy. I knew you all know that. You can't have joy. You can't make it through to next Mother's Day without the joy of the Lord. That's your secret weapon. Yeah, 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 yeah. You've been crying. You've been stressed. Hallelujah. But today, and the Holy Ghost is there to keep you, to strengthen you. The joy of the Lord is the weapon you use against the enemy. When he think you're going to die, you'll rise up and live. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Troubled on every side, yet not distressed. Cast down but not forsaken. Come on, somebody. After all, I still have joy. You can live intentionally with the Holy Ghost. On this road to Pentecost, I don't know if you, the pastor, going to send out a flyer to follow the road to Pentecost or not, as we did last year. But you lay aside every weight and every sin, I'm gonna let you go, that does so easily beset you. And run, you can run then. Lay aside anything that you may be holding. The hurt, the resentment, the spirit of rejection. Come on somebody. But the joy that have you praising God in the middle of what's going on. Let me tell you something. It's okay to cry. It's okay to cry. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. It's okay to cry. Don't let the, but don't let the devil get up in there and sit on you. Come on, somebody. Don't let him sit on you. David says he, he, he alluded to the fact that God was bottling up your tears. Come on, somebody. Uh huh. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. And, and I want you to know, he says, he that sow in tears shall reap in what? Joy. Y'all, y'all scared to say it. So, so, so tears has its benefits. 
It's okay, you ain't holding nothing in, talking about I'm strong. I, I know I ain't supposed to cry. I, I told somebody that the other day, they told me, I know I'm supposed to be strong and I ain't supposed to cry. I'm trying to be uh, uh, strong for my family. I said, what that mean? Count the three and I'll help you cry. Come on, somebody. <laughs> it don't mean that I've lost it. But who is that songwriter that said your tears are temporary release? But when I cry, I can still dance before the Lord as I cry. Because he is my joy in sorrow. He is my hope for tomorrow. And I know it's reaping time. Come on, somebody. If you've been crying, hallelujah, a lot lately, just know it's reaping time. You're going to reap in joy. Come on, somebody. You're going to reap in joy. Come on, ladybug. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. It's over. The depression is over. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Yes. So many losses, but your depression is over. Uh-huh. It's over. Keep pressing. Keep praising. Right in your house. Kick the devil out of your house. Right. Kick the spirit of depression out of your house. Right. You don't have to change curtains. You don't have to change your living room suit. You don't even have to change spaces or places or town. Just resist the devil. Yeah. And he'll flee. Thank, right. Thank you, Lord. Just lift your hands. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. Lord, we thank you. We thank you right now that your spirit is prevalent even now. <laughs> Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. We ask right now, God, that you feel, restore, rebuild, undergird us with the power of the Holy Ghost. Come on, somebody. Just say, feel me, Lord. If you have the Holy Ghost, come on, say, refill me. Come on, somebody. Refill me. Refill me. You heard the saying, once filled, but many refillings. And the devil has come to sift. Pastor, you're going to have a new membership after this. Because we are going to go home seeking the Holy Ghost. You don't have to wait till you come church be filled. You can be filled on your way home. If you're serious about the Lord, just lay aside everything you know that's not like him. And God will not dwell in an unclean temple, but clean up your house. Clean up your house. Clean up your house. Sanctify yourself. And the very God of peace will sanctify you holy. Hallelujah. And the joy that the God gives you through the Holy Ghost, the world can't take it away. Come on, somebody. The world can't. Those that things have been luring you. I've noticed that the world has been drawing you and luring you with those no harm things. But the Holy Ghost is going to come to complete you. And the world can't take it away. Come on, in the name of Jesus. Thank you for your spirit. Thank you for your spirit. Thank you for your full joy. In the name of Jesus, restore to us the joy of thy salvation and uphold us with a free spirit. In the name of Jesus, and we thank you. And we thank you. Come on, thank him. 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 Thank you. Thank you, Lord. We thank you for the joy. 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 Thank you. Thank you. And we give you praise today. And we give you praise. And we give you praise. Let the redeemed of the Lord say so. Let the redeemed of the Lord say so. Let the redeemed of the Lord say so. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. I don't know. Hallelujah. But I hear this little song say, this joy that I have, the world didn't give it to me, and we going home, I think. This joy that I have, the world didn't give it to me. But this joy that I have, the world didn't. The world didn't give it to me. Oh, the world. The world can't take it.
take it away. This joy. want to welcome you all to have dinner with us at Faith Temple Restaurant next door at the C.E. Ellis Fellowship Hall. You don't have to go to the restaurant, spend your money because it's all prepared, laid out, and it is waiting on you all. So once we're dismissed, please go next door and have our Mother's Day dinner. So please go fellowship next door, okay? Amen. The world didn't give it, the world didn't take it away. Hey, the world didn't give it, the world can't take it away. Hey, the world didn't give it, the world can't take it away. Come on, add something to it. The world didn't, and the devil, the, he not gonna steal my joy. The world, the devil can't take it away. I'm taking my joy back. Thank you, Lord. Now unto him that's able to keep us from falling and to present us faultless before the presence of his glory with exceeding joy. To the only wise God, our Savior, be glory and majesty, dominion and power, both now and ever. Let the word of God sink deep in your heart that you may seek him and that you may grow and be entire like in nothing. The world didn't give it. The world can't take it away. Come on, say thank God for the joy. Thank God for the joy. I don't know what your plans are, but you've been invited to eat with the ladies. The environmental committee, I 